Hier u in de naam van Jezus. Het einde is nabij. Bekeer u in de naam van Jezus. Het einde is nabij. Bekeer u in de naam van Jezus. Het einde is nabij. Bekeer u in de naam van Jezus. Het einde is nabij. Turn to Jesus Christ today. Call upon his holy name. For God is angry with the sins of the world. You can look back through your history at Sodom and Gomorrah. You can look back at Egypt, how God brought judgment upon them and buried their chariots at the bottom of the Red Sea. You must call upon the name of Jesus Christ. For we cannot pretend to be happy when we are not. For we must turn to Jesus Christ today. God spoke in his word through David, said, Do not chastise me in your hot displeasure. If you turn to Jesus Christ today and let his blood wash away your sin, he will give you another opportunity. He will give you a new start. He will give you a change in your life. But God will not bless abominations. He will not bless and promote evil in his sight. We must come back to Jesus Christ today. The Bible says, For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever would believe in him would not perish but have everlasting life. For God did not send his son into the world to condemn the world, but that the world through him might be saved. This is the condemnation that light has come into the world, and men love darkness rather than light because their deeds are evil. You must call upon the name of Jesus Christ today, and turn unto him before it is too late. Turn to Jesus Christ. He said, as it was in the days of Noah, so shall it be when the Son of Man comes. He said, they were eating, drinking, marrying, giving in marriage, laughing doing all the things that you see now that Jesus prophesied would be going on at the time of his second coming. But God will not bless unrighteousness. He will not bless or promote these uh, filthy things, these abominations. When we lift up these flags in front of his face, God will not do it. The Bible says he winked, once winked at ignorance, but now he said he commands every man to repent, that he's going to judge the world in righteousness by that man whom he hath ordained, which is Jesus Christ. The Bible says, feel after him. In fact, we might find him, but he is not far from each one of us. If you will reach out to God today and turn to Jesus Christ, he will give you an opportunity. You must open up the door of your heart. Don't be afraid of Jesus today. Don't be afraid of Jesus Christ today. Don't, don't let the devil trick you today. Don't let him pull you into his trap. The Bible says that hell is enlarging itself with its mouth opened wide without measure. Turn to Jesus Christ today. The Bible says that the devil would go about like a roaring lion, seeking him to live, and he may devour. But we have a will. We have, God gives us a choice to make. He gives us a decision to make, just like he gave Adam and Eve a choice in the garden. That they could live there. They could be free. They could be blessed. But he commanded them not to eat of the forbidden fruit. But they had a decision. They had a choice. When the devil came, he said, the Bible says Eve was deceived first. But you must turn to Jesus Christ and do not fall into his trap. For God has commanded us to abstain from sin and worldly lust. And all these things that he said sin has separated us from his faith, separated us from God. Bekir u in the name of Jesus. Het einde is nabij. Bekir u in the name of Jesus. Het einde is nabij. Bekeer u in de naam van Jezus. God's not going to bless these abominations, these things. God has brought nations to their knees before for promoting abomination, homosexuality, and different sin. We must call upon the name of Jesus Christ today. You may, may harden your heart today, but I beg you today to give Jesus a chance in your life. To open up your heart instead of hardening your heart. To hear the voice of the Lord crying in the streets, to turn unto him today. Do not neglect the salvation of Jesus Christ, for if we reject the blood of Jesus Christ today, there is no other sacrifice for our sin. Call upon him today. Bekir u in the name of Jesus. Het einde is nabij. Bekir u in the name of Jesus. Het einde is nabij. Bekeer u in de naam van Jezus. 
has aimed at its nabe. The Bible says, Go unto all the world and preach the gospel to every creature. 